Which is better, TV PCM or Bitstream? Hello, fellow audio enthusiasts. Today we're going to dive deep into the world of audio formats and find out the differences between TV PCM and Bitstream. This is a question that has puzzled many home theater aficionados, so let's get right to it and understand which of the two is better, TV PCM or Bitstream. What is PCM? PCM, or Pulse Code Modulation, is an audio format that you often see as an output option in your home entertainment system settings. PCM is a type of digital signal that represents analog data, such as audio. In simpler terms, PCM takes the original audio signal and samples it at regular intervals to create a digital representation. PCM is uncompressed, which means it's capable of producing very high-quality sound. What is Bitstream? On the other side of the debate, we have Bitstream. Bitstream, also known as Audio Bitstream or just Stream, is a digital audio format that, unlike PCM, passes the audio data in its compressed form to an AV receiver that then decodes the data to play the sound. This format is commonly used to send Dolby Digital and DTS surround sound formats over a single wire. PCM versus Bitstream, which is better? Now comes the meat of the matter, which one is better? The answer to this isn't a clear cut, PCM is better, or Bitstream is better. It really depends on your audio setup and what you want to achieve with your sound. If you have a high quality audio system that can handle PCM's uncompressed audio data, then PCM could offer the better audio quality. However, it's worth noting that this quality difference might not be noticeable to the average ear, especially if you're listening on typical home theater speakers. Bitstream, on the other hand, is more flexible and can support advanced surround sound formats like Dolby Atmos or DTS, X, which PCM cannot. Therefore, if you have a modern surround sound system and wish to make the most of these formats, Bitstream would be the better choice. So, in conclusion, both TV PCM and Bitstream have their own merits. Your choice should depend on your audio equipment and your listening preferences. We hope this video has helped clear up the differences between these two audio formats. Thanks for watching and keep those speakers pumping.